Hey, it's Charlotte Prepper. Look who's beside me, Mr. Happy. <laughs> yes, I'm sure you're all happy that I am starting this. So, um, I decided today that is the day and I'll do a little walkthrough um, to make sure everything's working properly. Um, very nervous about it. Uh, read the book a little bit more. Still having a little trouble, so I thought, well, I'll call the Presto customer service. And if she's listening, hello, thank you for your help. Um, I was very, very nervous about this, but I'm sure she was uh, getting a kick out of this. But anyway, um, so what we want to do when we do the walkthrough, first of all, um, you take a quart of water. It uh, doesn't matter if it's hot or cold. Just just put it in there. I did use cold. And make sure you know how to open and close your, your um your pot so and I learned it's the V's line up the V's on on this pot and of course you know use the close where it says close and open and close it and so I closed and have my little timer here set it for 15 minutes and the fun began the excitement and thrill began of me uh, wondering if this thing was going to bite me or not. <laughs> I made some noises and I thought I was going to jump out of my pants. Um, so don't worry about the, the little noise. Of course you're going to hear that noise. Um, some of the water did come up from where the, the temperature gauge is. And the piece, uh, the regulator, I guess it's called, um, that comes up and up and down, it will just uh, have a little water coming out of it. Not much, but a little. So I turned it off twice because that's how nervous I was. I was like, oh, it's not supposed to do that. This place is going to blow. <laughs> so I, cl I closed it off. Um, well, um, I turned it back on, decided to let her hold my hand through the process and um, got it going again and it wasn't working um, so that is where the troubleshooting came in so I had to take the, the, the temperature gauge off and um, go from the, the back end because see you can't have any of the white showing here I did not know that the rubbery part you cannot have that showing or it's not going to work because this thing didn't move. And so I took the thing off, all the way off from the from the back end and and put it through the back end so that the piece, uh, the, the rubbery piece and the other silver ring um, could be attached coming from the back side. Put, and, and with my other hand, get this and put it on the outside where it's supposed to be and tighten it and make sure that white piece so so then we decided to do it again and here I am like oh me here here it goes now so I uh, I said you think it's gonna be okay you think it's gonna you think it's gonna work um, it's not it's not, is it okay and she said yeah it's fine and so but this oh this needs to be put on too when you're doing this and I I was thinking this thing had to be off but anyway I put that um, right up there uh, set my timer for 15 minutes cut it on high I've got gas stove and let it go and it works so I'm over my fear I can go on and proceed and can now everything is fine um, I'm, I'm so grateful to have presto customer service they d did a great job explaining things and walking me through the process and staying on the phone with me so guys i am ready to begin canning um now i gotta figure out what i'm gonna can i've got some uh, a lot of beans and stuff so 
be watching out for my canning video coming very soon. Thank you for watching and you have a blessed day. Bye.